As we get closer to the summer months, one of the natural beauties in Kern County, the Kern River. 17's Ileana Capian joins us now with more on efforts to bring water back to the riverbed. The Kern River has been the main focus of attention for the Bring Back the Kern organization. This organization partnered with a local newspaper writer turned author and graphic design artist turned illustrator to bring more awareness to the ongoing efforts to rewater the Kern River. This collaboration is bringing awareness through a new children's book called The Mighty Kern River. Check it out. This is Indy. This is also Indy. And this too is Indy. Indy was the inspiration for a children's book series called Indy O oh Indy. Indy's owner and author of the series, Teresa Adamo, takes readers of all ages on adventures around Kern County with the help of colorful illustrations by Jennifer Williams Cardova. The latest book in the Indy Presents series is called The Mighty Kern River. Adamo and Williams Cardova were approached by a local community group, Bring Back the Kern, to write an educational book about the Kern River and the surrounding environment. They had watched the indie books um, progress and knew that we had an audience and we were making that connection with Bakersfield history. Mm -hmm. And they asked if we might be interested in doing a story um, about the river. This story is part of the ongoing effort by Bring Back the Kern to raise awareness around Bakersfield's need for a flowing river year-round. As Adamo and Williams Cardova began brainstorming, the creative juices flowed onto the paper, and before long, they felt a connection to their newest story about the river. It basically takes you on a tour through the Kern River from the top all the way down to the Buena Vista Lake, and it, it's educational. It talks about the different aspects of the river, um, but in a fun way. The book features new characters, and while Indy is not the main character in this adventure, she still makes a cameo. The story shows a utopian version of the river. Adamo says it's an example of what they would like the river to look like all the time. We want uh, kids and families to realize that we have this natural resource. I mean, I think after the book comes out, um, so it's, you know, fingers crossed, we want to hear those stories of people saying that they went to go see it, or they spent some time there, or they went camping, or they went up to the Kern Valley and did one of the river rafting trips. This collaboration with Bring Back the Kern is meant to instill a sense of pride in the Kern River and bring awareness to a more often than not dry river. But before a single book is printed, the duo must meet a goal of $6,500 in pre-sales before May 23rd. If they don't meet this goal, their project won't be funded at all, and printing costs won't be able to be met. Kickstarter is an online funding platform for creative projects. This platform is an all-or-nothing platform, so the ladies either meet their entire goal of $6,500 by May 23rd, or the donors won't have to pay for anything and the book won't be able to be printed. Now, for every six-pack reward level pledged, Indio Indy will donate one copy of the Mighty Kern River to the Kern County Library, and that helps spread awareness and knowledge of the Kern River. Now, for more information and to purchase your copy of the Mighty Kern River, head to our website, kget.com. In studio, Ileana Capellan, 17 News. Love right. that story. I know. I love those books. They're so cute. Yeah.